So our patient is 85 years old, has a suspicion of aortic stenosis, but we want to know the degree of the stenosis. So what are the next steps? But I would not rely only on the morphology, I would rely more on the continuous wave Doppler that we place through the aortic valve. And we do that in a five-chamber view, ideally, so that we are better oriented to the flow of blood through the stenotic valve, so that the septum is usually slanted a little bit the way you have it in our view right here. And then you put the continuous wave Doppler through, and then you would simply just trace the curve. And at that time, you would not only get the mean gradient, but also the maximal gradient. So here we are, uh, we have a stenosis which is somewhere in the range of moderate to severe. Uh, the mean gradient is 40 millimeters of mercury. The maximal gradient is somewhere in the range of almost 60 millimeters of mercury. So this certainly could be her problem.